the panel runs on dual operating system so one is android operating system and the other operating system will run on the built-in ops or which is known as built-in computer as well to switch just you need to select the source now the ops comes with i5 processor for 8 gb ram and 256 gb ssd this is our uh, built-in ops module so you can install windows or linux any of the operating system on the ops now ops comes with i5 processor 8 gb ram and 256 gb ssd if you want to upgrade you can upgrade the specification as per your requirement now ops has built-in wi-fi bluetooth uh, lan usc ports so all the uh, input ports are available now with ops we are providing another writing software which is known as maxboard so now maxboard comes with various type of pen so you can select the pen thickness and color you can use your hand for palm eraser we have built in recognition pen so anything you write freehand will be converted to perfect text same you can use for converting the shape so any shape you draw freehand will be converted to perfect shape you have option to split the screen into two parts so that multiple users can write at the same point of time so let's say user number one is using red color pen and user number two is using blue color pen so two users can write at the same point of time now it has some built-in shapes like cube cylinder so these types of 3d shapes are available then it has some interactive mathematic tools like protector so from drop down you can select the function to draw an angle and then you can easily draw angle of the desired degree in a similar way you have built in compass where you can define the radius and then you can draw arc or sector you have various other tools like built in browser so you can search the content like I am searching for solar system I can select the content from the browser and then I can easily drag and drop it on my screen in a similar way we can drag and drop the image as well we have built in inner mode option which again you can use for rough presentation or you can use it for hiding the answers okay. we have option for spotlight so let's say if i want to focus on particular one area of the screen so i can use my spotlight feature it has built in live map so i can zoom in zoom out i can annotate over the map even i can crop the portion of the map and insert it on my whiteboard so this is how i can easily crop anything annotate over the content and then i can insert on my whiteboard now another tool is for max formula where you can write any max formula freehand and it will be converted to proper type formula so let's say you have written a square plus b square is equal to 2 insert and here you can see the formula has been converted to type text we have on screen built in calculator you have option to insert table so i can customize the table three rows and four columns and with a single click i can get the 
contained on my the table on my screen. Further, we have built-in games like Arithmetic, where students need to select two numbers, of, for, for which the result is two. So let's say I selected first number seven and second number is five, and then I can submit the result. So this is how we can use these tools. Uh, built-in. Uh, this is how we can use this built-in game for creating a session interactive. Similarly, here you can see multiple games are available. Now here we have option to insert pages. So as you can see, we have already inserted multiple pages. So n number of pages can be inserted. You have option to change the background. You have option to select subjective background like maths, graph, science, English, Hindi. Means all the subjective backgrounds are available. Then you have option to scan QR code and upload your file on the panel. Another option you have to scan the QR code and download the content on your devices. Then you have some built-in resources. Let's say for chemistry, we have built-in periodic table. Again, you can select the pen, color, and you can do the annotation over the content. You have option to save the file, you can select save as, and from the drop down, you can select multiple extensions like PDF, PPT, Word, and then with a the click, you can save the file on the system. Encrypt the file so that only the authorized person can edit the file or can access the file. You can minimize the software and then you have option to annotate over any content. So let's say if today I am teaching some, anything uh, over the internet to split the screen. So on one hand side you can have the whiteboard and on the other hand side you can have your browser or any other content so one side you can use for writing the content and on the other side you can browse the content even if you want to annotate on the browser so we have built-in annotation feature available so let's say if i want to mark on some particular points so I can use this built-in annotation feature. So these are some uh, features that are available within a whiteboard software in Windows mode.